The Duke of Edinburgh Handicap. One mile, six furlongs, zero to 93-year-old up. Annex El Greco, Darren Thompson is up the top. With Brave New World, Carnelian, Carol Rampage, Beholder, Column Sile, Dark, Destination Bomber, Papatia, Dance Desire, Captivity Balafray, uh, Cal Tide, Eternity Crystal, McAuliffe Class, and Hello Gorgeous for Kevin Minahan. And they're off. Little slow and destroyed captivity Balafray. Pushing forward early is uh, Mart's horse, Papatia. We've got Beholder as we come into this bend here out of the straight. And a couple caught wide. One of them's Grey's horse, Eternity Crystal. So Papatia leads by about two and a half to three. Destination Bomber, Unexcel Greco, then Eternity Crystal. Uh, Carnelian's out in the centre of the track with Dance Desire, then back down on the fences. Uh, Column Sile, Dark, Cal Tide, Carol Rampage, uh, Captivity Balafray, Brave New World, uh, Michaeliff Class, and Hello Gorgeous at the tail. Over the crossing. And Papatia is a comfortable leader. From Annex El Greco. On the fence in the black and white square is Destination Bomber. Getting closer, Carnelian and Eternity Crystal. Also up there, Dance Desire and Captivity Balafray. And uh, Brave New World midfield, and then just worse of midfield there, we've got Colin Sol, Dark Cow Rampage, Beholder, Cow Tide, Michael of Class, and Hello Gorgeous. No change to the order. Six furlongs left to run, 1200 metres, and up this rise here. The leader's doing it nicely, Papatia from Eternity Crystal, who's moved forward with Captivity Balafray, Unix El Greco, Destination Bomber, Dance Desire, Carnelian. Brave New World just worst of midfield now with uh, Commissil Dark, Cal Tide, uh, Carol Rampage, Beholder, Michael of Class, and Hello Gorgeous whips them in. So they come on down to the three furlong pole and Papatia has opened up a lead here, at least two and a half to Unex El Greco. Eternity Crystal is now only two off the fence, running on nicely. Carol Rampage from the tail of the field at the two furlong and it's still Papatia in front from Eternity Crystal. Then Carol Rampage is the only one really running on now as they come on down to the furlong. It's Papatia in front. Carol Rampage is getting up on the outside. Carol Rampage takes the lead now from Papatia and Column Sol Dark. So they come on down to the line. Column Sol Dark picks up the bid and wins from Papatia. I think Martin's, uh, no, Martin's horse was second. I just uh, quickly forgot third there. But this was uh, an excellent finish. Oh, he stopped riding on Carol Rampage. Trainer will be absolutely smacking the desk. But Steve Rand gets a uh, timely winner. Column sold dark. Second Papatia for Martin Leadham. Third, the unlucky Carol Rampage. Jockey stop riding. D. Allen. Sack him. Captivity Balafray. T. Rogers ran fourth, which is a good run. And beholder Dan Hughes got up for fifth. So that's good news there.